Space dust is one of those things that Earth expansion conspiracists say is the reason why Earth got bigger. Now, I can kind of see why they think that, because when you add something to a system, you would expect the system to grow bigger. And just for everyone out there, Earth expansion theory was something that was rather popular before the 1950s when uh, they were trying to understand how Earth's plates moved. Uh, back in 1912, a meteorologist called Alfred Wegener noticed that the continent seems to fit together, such as Africa and South America, and therefore came up with the idea of continental drift, but just couldn't explain how the drifting occurred. Now, obviously, with the advent of sonar sort of mapping and submarine mapping, we've figured out that the oceanic crust literally is ripped apart at spreading ridges, and that's how the plate has moved. But before that, they thought that one option was the Earth expansion theory, which was in its younger infantile, I guess, state. Earth, all of the continents were clumped together, and just like a balloon expanding, they basically split apart, meaning that the plates didn't actually have to move away from each other, they just moved away from each other from a central point. And one of the arguments I heard recently was that every day there are over 100 metric tons of space dust falling to the Earth, which equates to around 40,000 metric tons per year. Now, if you multiply that over four and a half billion years, that is a lot of space dust. And that's kind of how the Earth could have got bigger. That number equates to 180 trillion metric tons. Huge, colossal, mind blowing. But, and there's always a but, Firstly, we have to assume that this rate of 100 metric tons a day is constant. It probably went more as you went further back in time uh, because of the amount of asteroids and just overall leftovers of the accretionary disk and all that sort of stuff. But the key narrative here is you have to look at it in proportion to how big the Earth is. The Earth's mass is 6,000 billion billion tons. Billion billion no 180 trillions come close to that number. That is 0.000003% of the Earth's mass. So no, there is no amount of space dust that's fallen over four and a half billion years that could allow the Earth to grow at least one third more its size. Sorry it took so long to get to that number, but hey, you needed some context. If you like this video, like, comment, share, follow.